Hey guys, welcome to the Fire Tonight channel. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. I really want to get 2000 subscribers on my YouTube channel. Thanks for supporting me, guys. Now we start the video. On Saturday night, Garcia put another powerful display, dispatching Fortuna with three knockdowns in row to the win, and he immediately took to the microphone after his victory to take aim at his long-term foe. 100%, I felt way better, Garcia responded when asking about his 5 pounds weight increase. I'm not going back down to 135 pounds for nothing, but I will fight Tank Davies next. If Tank wants that at 140, I'm going to record all the negotiations so that you guys don't make no headlines saying I'm talking. If he wants it, let's get it. It is going to give me the respect I deserve and I'm never afraid. I'm trying to tell you that I have the spirit of competition in me and you're going to see it come out when I fight Tank and whip his ass. Where there is a will, there is a way. Davis then posted a cryptic response on social media, writing, See you all at the end of the year. Despite not responding to the call out by naming Garcia, Davis was clearly gustering that he is ready to enter negotiations to fight Davis. Garcia fought for the second time in barely six months after going the distance against Emmanuel Tagoy. He started slowly against Fortuna and was caught twice by his rival in the opening round, which left him holding on. He settled down in the second period started to dominate proceedings. Friends, before starting to watch this video, I would like to ask you to subscribe to my channel. If you really enjoy the content, then please, subscribe to my channel and keep watching the videos. If you are subscribed, then receive notifications about the release of new videos. You do not even have to look for anything personally. I really want to get 2000 subscribers on my channel. I'm trying very hard, absolutely every day, and I need your support. Your likes, comments, reposts to social networks. Thanks for support me, guys. By the fourth round, Garcia started to fire away at Fortuna and he made his break throw with the whipping left hook to the body, which saw his opponent take a knee. Garcia then found a second opening in the fifth round, catching him with a short left hook, leaving him on the canvas again. His next break throws was an all important one, with a 1 2 combination sending his opponent down and leaving his unable to beat the count. The referee waved off the contest leaving Garcia one step closer to a challenge against Davies. Garcia's promoter Oscar de la Hoya confirmed that talks will now begin to stage why he believes he is the biggest fight in boxing. That's the fight that we are going to go after I strongly feel that the only way this fight can happen is by the fans rallying behind Ryan and myself and beating the drum and making noise, he said. Let's make this fight happen. Daddy Garcia talks Garcia Davis. Label Tank the biggest star in America. Danny Garcia believes that Jadwanta Davis is the biggest boxing star in America. The former two-weight world champion has been a professional for nearly 15 years and has seen many a household name come and go, arrested and recuperated after a break from the sport swift, makes his return to the ring this Saturday night against Jose Benavides. The 34-year-old has moved up to super welterweight as he begins his campaign to become a three-division world champion. On Saturday, Garcia fights at the Berkeley Center in Brooklyn, a venue that has become his fighting home for several years. On May 20, Jerwan Davis also fought at the arena in front of a bumper crawl that saw tanks stop to Rolando Romero in six rounds. Speaking to media ahead of Saturday's fight, Garcia had this to say about Davis. I think Jerwan Davis might be the biggest star in America. He sells out Georgia, he sells out Berkeley Center, he is a big star. Ryan Garcia is another big star, social media star. Davis vs. Ryan Garcia is high on the wish list for many a boxing fan, and then he says, should a super fight happen, then everyone is a winner. First of all, Ryan's been looking great since he came back. He looked great against Fortuna. I thought Fortuna would be better, but Ryan was a classy ball. I think that's a great fight for both of them. Both of them are young superstars. I think it's a big fight. I think it's a great fight for both of them. There is no loser in that fight. When you fight the best, you don't lose. Danny Garcia said. Thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I really want to get 2000 subscribers on my YouTube channel.